We're gonna take a flat artwork like this one and use Photoshop to wrap it around a cylindrical object like this one to create a nice 3D label mock-up like this one. In the June 2022 release of Photoshop, Adobe introduced the Cylindrical Transform Warp feature. It sure sounds like something we can use for this project, doesn't it? I've opened this Photoshop file and as you can see here in the layers panel, I have a background layer, a layer called base, which is basically where the label is going to be placed, the flat label or sticker itself, and the group that contains the bottle's cap and body with some shadows and highlights. By the way, I downloaded this file using the link in the description. Let's start by right clicking on the sticker and converting it to a smart object. That way we'll be working non-destructively. Next, press Ctrl or Command T to free transform and resize and reposition the label over the bottle. But don't press enter yet. You need to activate the warp button. To do that, go to the options bar and click here to activate the warp button. Open the warp drop-down menu here and choose the new cylinder option. When you do that, some on-screen controls show up. The top center control point changes the arc of the upper and lower boundaries at the same time. The bottom center control point adjusts only the bottom curvature. The top right and bottom left corner control points allow you to resize the entire label. And the center control point allows you to control the perspective by moving it left and right. And now, now you can press enter to confirm. Last step is to hold down Alt or Option, hover the cursor between the sticker and the base, and then click once to create a clipping mask. That way the label is only visible inside the boundaries of the base layer, which is exactly what you want, isn't it? It isn't? <laughs> Why are you even here? <laughs> 